Manfred Weber, the EPP's candidate to become the next European Commission president, threatened to back a move to throw out the anti-EU leader and his Fidesz party ahead of the European elections in May. The EU is made up of political groupings which bring together parties from across Europe which generally stand for similar policies. But Mr. Orban's future inside the centre-right EPP has been included on the agenda for the group's political assembly on March 20. The event is scheduled to approve the party's manifesto ahead of the European Parliament elections in May but instead could be used to send a strong message to the Hungarian leader. Ahead of the Brussels summit, Mr. Weber told reporters, all options are on the table, especially the option of expulsion, and for us to go our future way without Fidesz, we have a new situation today in the party. Leo Varadkar's Finnegal is to join 12 other EPP parties demanding the Hungarian Prime Minister's expulsion. An expulsion could cause a crisis for the EPP, led by European Commission President Jean-Claude Juncker and European Parliament. President Donald Tusk, as the Fidesz party's 12 seats could mean the difference between the EPP being the biggest party in the EU or not. Mr. Orban infuriated his colleagues in the centre-right bloc with a government campaign focused on Mr. Juncker, the European Commission president and senior EPP member. Jean-Claude Juncker's EPP on course to kick Viktor Orban out of Party image Getty, Budapest sent a scathing one-page letter to households across Hungary, which insisted the EU has not learned anything from the horrible terror attacks of the past years, and wants to bring even more migrants to Europe. The anti-EU onslaught also included a taxpayer-funded poster campaign, which also targets Mr. Juncker and the European Commission. You have the right to know. What Brussels is planning to do, the poster reads, accusing Mr. Juncker and billionaire philanthropist George Soros of undermining member states' rights to protect their own borders. In a letter to EPP President Joseph Dahl, Mr. Weber said he would insist that Mr. Orban is kicked out of the party unless he puts a halt to his anti-immigration campaign. Mr. Weber Road, if Fidesz, led by Viktor Orban, fails to meet the above-mentioned requirements, the only option would be to exclude the party from the EPP, the repeated attacks on EPP leaders, the unwillingness to resolve the open infringement procedures and in recent days, the attacks against other EPP member parties severely damaged the unity of our party, Mr. Orban's most fiercest critics. Inside the EPP face an uphill battle to expel him and his party because efforts by senior figures, including parliamentary leader Manfred Weber, to stop further divides between East and West. The 12 seats occupy to Fidesz are vitally important to the EPP and could be the difference in commanding the position of the European Parliament's strongest party as the threat of a large-scale Eurosceptic bloc being formed grows. According to EPP rules, the suspension or exclusion of a member party can be triggered by seven ordinary or associated member parties from five different countries, offering the Hungarian leader an olive branch. Mr. Weber said there is a way back into the EPP if he changes his ways. The German MEP said Viktor Orban must immediately and permanently end his government's anti-Brussels campaigns.